think I'm better than you Nah, I'm just I see Stand in toes and paint the haters Try to indict me Try to throw their hands up at it Try to fight me And I, and I, and I, I can't let you take my life be. Think I'm better than you Nah, I'm just I see What? I can't look at you? I just... Mm -hmm. Sup? No. Oh, yeah. Hey, you better... What you doing? Watching. No. Hello, you like... everyone. My name is Sir Spooks, <laughs> and today we'll take a look at five scary videos. So, let's begin. Wow. Abandoned mine shafts are some of the most unsettling places anybody can venture into. Mine shaft? There's just something highly creepy about walking into a dark mine shaft with nothing but you and a small flashlight oh. to help you guide your way. And if you're like YouTuber TBR exploring, you could potentially find something disturbing while exploring too. Oh. In a video uploaded on December 25th, 2019, we can see the channel's owner recording himself as he walks inside an abandoned Soviet mine. And at first, nothing really seems out of the ordinary. He shows us a couple of things- That- where, the, where he's at? God, I hope he's not there alone, physically. I hope he's not there alone. But it looks like he is. So, I mean, that- uh, God. So, just- just open. Cause I feel like you just- Open it all slow. <laughs> um, but yeah, I feel I so I really hope he's not there alone. But if he is, oh my god. Um, but then I was also gonna say, um, that that yeah, the place that he's in, I forgot what he called it, even though he just said it a mine something, a Soviet something, but it looks like that's where a lot of people died. So, he's not there alone. Oh, God. And that, I'm not even there, and I'm already getting creeped out. Like, I'm already getting chills. Like, don't you know how you just look at something, and it's just like, oh, you get chills? Yeah, that's, that's a, oh. Area, like a workbench, that was still in there, as well as the mine straining system. And that was seemingly all that he captured. But something very eerie happens around the same time that frightened the man. Take a listen. Workbench here. And some equipment. They've got a good drainage system. It's working the way it's supposed to. You see the water's shunted off to the side here. And it's flowing out, which is what you want. There's some of the uh, stuff on the workbench. I'm not even really sure where to begin with this one. But if you go back, turn the volume up, and listen to that last section again, where I abruptly tapered off, you'll hear this otherworldly scream or howl coming out from deeper within the mine. Step on a workbench. I hear it! Damn! Stop right there, don't go no further. Don't go no further. The channel owner explains that he has no idea what he heard in the mine that day, and also says that he is a big skeptic when it comes to all things related to the paranormal, and talks about the scream that he heard while in the mine. He also said that it genuinely creeped him out, and he still to this day has no idea what he heard in the mine that day. What do you think the sound was? Leave your thoughts in the comments below. Walking around in a strange and unfamiliar area, especially late at night, could be downright terrifying. You think? But it seems like this is exactly what YouTuber Leviathan did on January 11th, 2020, in a video sent to me with the title, Would Someone Tell Me What This Is? The video, which is only a minute in length, seems pretty natural at first, although there's most definitely an unsettling vibe and atmosphere that you will get when watching it. The area he walks around seems almost too quiet. 
like you could hear a pin drop. Towards the end of the video, he seemingly opens a door where he sees a parked vehicle, but what happens next is truly creepy. Come on. Come <laughs> SHIT! A bizarre, almost otherworldly sound can be heard coming from the area where Leviathan was standing. I saw something. It sounded like it could have either been some sort of creature or a very unnerving sounding person. It seems like we may never know what he heard that day, but what we do know is that this is a sound that you would never want to hear late at night. Oh, God. This next intro Ew. comes to us from oh. some sort of a Japanese cooking show, and is only 20 seconds in length. Everything seems like it would on a normal cooking show. The camera is pointed on a man who is enjoying a bowl of noodles, but eagle-eyed viewers may see something that will chill their bones. Take a look and see if you can spot it. <laughs> oh, ow, oh, 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 God. Oh. Huh. Fuck. Oh. Oh, God. I just, hold on. Just give me like five, five, ten more seconds. I'm, oh. Okay, no, no, we all right, we good. I thought it was gonna be something in in his bowl that was gonna scare me. I don't know if y'all see it, but I saw it. I was a little late to it, but I somehow I may not still see it, but I see it. Jesus, it's like it's like one of those uh. If you, when you see it, your shit bricks, it's one of those. If you did not see it, when the camera angle is from the other side of the man, oh. you can see an incredibly creepy head poking out from the corner, out from the darkness. It seems like nobody on the show noticed this either, as they carry on as if nothing happened. To be fair, this could be something as simple as one of the crew members poking their head in the room during taping. 
but it could also be the ghost of somebody making their appearance on TV. Wow. This was a video that was uploaded all the way back in 2012, and it seems like there's been no explanation given to this video after all these years. What do you think it was in the video? Was it just a person peeking their head in, or was it a ghost? I don't care. This next one was sent to me directly by the channel Moxley's Crazy Adventures, who frequently uploads videos of itself exploring abandoned buildings and typically uploads all things paranormal and exploration related and has done so since July of 2019. On January 12th, 2020, he uploaded a video of himself exploring an abandoned and haunted workshop, and for a while, nothing <coughs> so crazy happens. Yeah, we get to see some of the creepy interior, but besides that, everything seems fairly normal. That is, however, until we get to about 14 minutes into the video, when something strange happens. No. What? Oh, what? What? You got it. That's your that's your signal to get the hell out of here. So what are you doing? Don't go towards the all right, clock it. Oh, that ball just rolled from this side. You didn't just be clock it. What man? I'm in the head yeah. Sorry about that. Who's in it? A ball rolls right down the hallway, almost like it did in the 1980s Stanley Kubrick film, The Shining, where a young Danny Torrance is playing on the floor, and a ball suddenly rolls right up to him. But if that wasn't creepy enough, just two minutes or so later, Moxley hears something very strange while in one of the workshop's many rooms. Let's take a listen. Let's put it, Box. The voice which said, just going to talk to him, certainly does not sound like it was that of a person's voice. Instead, it sounded like a ghost, as the voice sounded a little bit muffled and almost like a whisper. Do you think that this was the voice of a ghost captured on camera, or was it just the voice of a person? Let me know in the comments. The Urban Project is a YouTube channel that follows the channel owner as he explores abandoned buildings and is a destination for all things supernatural. This video which he sent to me showcases him as he does a 3am solo challenge at the Burgess farm. As he walks around the farm, everything seems fairly normal except for the rundown look that the building has. But besides all of the creepy and unsettling atmosphere, Nothing really strange happens until about 16 minutes in. The man recording walks around a little bit more, but he has something that spooks him. You do some like this alone. Some people would never dream about doing it alone. But I'm going to have to the side now. I'm just going to keep it going. I'm not going to quit. During the video, he is seen exploring the Burgess farm all by himself, meaning that there should not be anybody else in the building with him that could have possibly made that sound. It could have been simply another person pulling a prank on him, or another person also attempting to explore the area. But it could also be a mysterious and dangerous ghost knocking things around in the building. And that was five scary videos. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, then subscribe for more scary content. My name is Sir Spooks, and I'll see you all in the next video. That one right there. That, I think that one took the cake.
You ruined you ruined the whole thing. Um I'ma retitle this the title of this video. Um probably like a try not to flinch challenge because you can't not look at this and not flinch. Not even like a little. So yeah. And then if I if I title it that, then I definitely lost. But I should have I should have figured that out. I, I should have like um s determined whether I was gonna title title the video this, like try not to flinch in the beginning of the video so I can be prepared. But obviously and I lost, but the one that really took the cake Oh, would have to be the, uh, what number was it though? No, well, yeah, no, it, that one comes close, but number three, two comes close, but number three, not the fart. Sorry. Number three. That that really, that really got me. Cause it's like those are the ones that like if you once you see it your shit breaks. Those are the ones that give me like heart heart attacks. Those are the ones that like that yeah that 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 yeah. oh god. Cause for the longest I was looking at his bowl of food and I thought it was gonna be something in there. To scare me. I didn't even think about looking everywhere else. Oh my god. Quick question. If y'all can find a video. That has. Um, like clips. Or images. Of the. Um, of the. Once you see it. Your shit bricks. On YouTube or something. Let me put let me let me know. Let me know like in the comment section below. Cause I would definitely love to react to that. Even though my heart may may not love it. But this whole video was great. Um I really enjoy your videos. Keep them coming. But number three, you 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 got me. That oh god. But I'm still I'm still on edge right now. I probably will be until <sighs> until I listen to some gospel. Keep it cool, keep it classy, and I love you. Stay happy. My family.